This is not an acid in the same sense as popular ingredients, glycolic and salicylic acid. Rather, it's a naturally occurring sugar molecule that is a key component of youthful, bouncy skin. Alas, our ability to produce hyaluronic acid declines with age. It's a water holding gel with a very special ability to hold 10,000 times its own weight in moisture. When we inject it into our skin's deeper layer, the dermis, it plumps up wrinkles and gets broken down slowly over the course of months so it produces long lasting results. And this is what's known as dermal fillers. When it's applied on top of the skin in a cream, however, it's a very different story. The skin acts as a highly effective barrier and hyaluronic acid is simply too large to get across into the dermis where it needs to get to if it's going to help with wrinkles structurally. However, what it can do is sit on the surface and act as a moisturizer through its water attracting properties. This means it draws water into the skin to keep it hydrated, supple and functioning effectively as a barrier. This will produce a temporary improvement in lines and wrinkles as all moisturizers do. It's a safe, effective moisturizer and isn't occlusive, so won't trigger breakouts in those who are acne prone. It's best used in humid conditions. This means it will draw moisture from the air rather than the deeper layers of the skin.